We know Roux-en-Y gastric bypass is the most effective surgical therapy for weight loss. Patients typically lose around 80% of their excess weight during the first year after the surgery. However, after around two to three years post-bypass, some patients will encounter weight regain. And by 10 years, most will have regained a third or more of the weight that they lost. There are several reasons for weight regain after bariatric surgery. In patients undergoing a gastric bypass, there are two main anatomic reasons that drive this. The gastric pouch that was created to limit the amount of food you can eat often expands over time. The second and probably the more important reason for weight regain is the stretching of the gastric outlet. This is the connection between the gastric pouch and the small bowel. Studies show that for every one millimeter the outlet increases in size, that patients regrain their weight in a linear fashion. There are several options available for patients that regain weight after gastric bypass. Of course, you can try diet and lifestyle interventions or even medications, but unfortunately they don't seem to work for everyone. Another option would be surgical revision, but often the surgeons are reluctant to do this because it is a technically challenging surgery with increased rates of adverse events. With the advancement of endoscopic suturing devices, there's now a range of minimally invasive endoscopic options that leave you with no additional scars. This animation depicts the endoscopic transoral outlet reduction procedure. At the time of Rouen Y gastric bypass, the surgeons create a small gastric pouch which they attach to your small bowel. Where they are joined together is known as the gastric outlet. The diameter of the gastric outlet after the surgery is usually 10 to 12 millimeters in size, and because it is so small, it restricts the amount of food exiting the stomach, making you feel full after just a few bites. Unfortunately, over time, the size of the outlet often increases in size, allowing you to eat larger portions and not feel as full as quickly as you initially did after the surgery. You may also start to notice the return of symptoms of dumping syndrome, such as nausea, low blood sugar, fatigue or dizziness. As you can see in this animation, with dilation of the gastric outlet, Food rapidly passes out of the pouch into the small bowel, triggering these symptoms. To remedy this situation, we can perform an endoscopic procedure that uses an endoscopic suturing device to reduce the outlet back to its original 10 to 12 millimeters in diameter. After the procedure, you might have some short-lived pain or nausea but we have excellent medications to get you through this. The procedure is well tolerated and takes less than an hour to complete. We aim that you will go home the same day and most people return to their normal activities of daily living within a week. A laparoscopic sleeve gastrectomy is another very common bariatric surgery. Although very effective in most, after a few years, like those undergoing gastric bypass, some will start to notice weight regain. On average, patients regain a third of the weight that they have lost at around seven years post-surgery. As most of the weight regain is driven by the sleeve stretching out over time, we can now reset things by reducing the stomach back to its original post-surgical size with a minimally invasive incisionless procedure called an endoscopic re-sleeve or a revision endoscopic sleeve gastroplasty. The encouraging thing about these endoscopic options is that for many, it can feel like a second surgery and a complete reset. Patients report feeling full and only able to eat very small portions post-procedure. Patients can expect to lose somewhere between 10 and 15% of their total body weight and maintain this for up to five years post-procedure. At Johns Hopkins, we very much believe in a comprehensive multidisciplinary approach to weight management. 
In order to help you stay on track and achieve your weight loss goals, you will be followed closely after the procedure by a comprehensive team of endobariatric and obesity medicine specialists.